Let's write the fraction 4 fifteenths as a decimal. So to start out, 4, that's smaller than 15. So when we divide 4 by 15, we should get a number less than 1, our decimal. So let's do this. We'll take 4, and we want to know how many times 15 goes into 4. Well, 15 doesn't go into 4, but we could call this 40 if we put a 0 and a decimal point up here. Now, 2 times 15, that's 30. When we subtract, we get 10. 15 doesn't go into 10, so we're going to call this 100 and move over one decimal place. 6 times 15, that's 90. And we subtract, we get 10. And we're going to make it 100, move over 1. 6 times 15, that's 90. We subtract, we get 10, call it 100. And you can see, we're going to just keep getting 6 here. 6 is going to repeat in this fraction. So we could say that the fraction 4 fifteenths that equals the decimal 0 0.26666. Or we could take these sixes that repeat here and just put a bar over the six here, call it 0 0.26 with the bar over it. That's the same thing as 4 fifteenths, the fraction. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.